Hey guys, I'm Lawrence. And I'm Josh. And today's video, we bring you an early access game that's on the rise. That's right, it's Speedrunners, the fastest game around. In a city with an abundance of superheroes, it's only natural that competition would arise. In Speedrunners, Speedrunner, Uni, Cosmonaut Comrade, Hothead and Moonraker compete against one another in blazing races to determine who's the fastest. However, uh, you're not racing to get to a finish line, but to go so fast that your opponents can't keep up and get eliminated. There is one shared screen, and if you lag behind and fall off, you will get eliminated. To win a game, you have to take out three rounds. Once a round finishes, another starts, right where the last one ended with all players respawned. These races take place on unique circuits that total up to 10 amongst 4 players. These players include you obviously, as well as bots and other players both online and locally. To run, you simply use your arrow keys in your desired direction, and the longer you run, the faster you get. You can also jump with Z, grapple with X, use items with C, and duck with the down key. Grappling is only necessary to swing over gaps, but when used right, it can propel you further and build momentum. Momentum is really the key to this game. With it, you can speed past your competitors, but when you lose it, you'll struggle to keep up. Momentum can be broken up by missing a jump and hitting an obstacle, but even if you make all the right moves, opponents can disrupt you. This is courtesy of an array of items found in the circuits a la Mario Kart, such as a homing missile, a grapple that slingshots enemies back, and a relentless drill. If you ever want to mix up the standard formula, there are game options that keep things fresh. You can have rockets rain down to intensify the difficulty, up the speed to insane levels and much more. On top of multiplayer, there is a light story mode called Origins, which is a good place to get a grip on the game. The other mode is Workshop, where you can build your own stages to use in your races. To me, Speedrunners is the ultimate pick up and play game. If you are bored or just want to waste some time, open up Speedrunners and play for half an hour. Currently there's no online ranking system, which means you just play for fun and it's great with friends. For an early access game, it's ticked all the right boxes for me. Full marks, 10 out of 10. Speedrunners just oozes coolness. With its quick action, it makes for an enthralling competitive and social game. Plus, its superhero creations kick ass, especially Cosmonaut Comrade, who packs so many of my favourite things, including alliterations, 20th century history, and dope slides. The indie games that make it are the ones that get you to tell your friends about them, and Speedrunners definitely does that. 9 out of 10. Well, that's Speedrunners for you. And if you want to be in the know about other great indie games, remember to subscribe. Thanks for watching, I've been Lawrence. And I've been Josh, we'll see you next time here on Indie Former. Well, that's speedrunners for you. And if you want to be in no, no, no.